2017 Lamborghini Huracan LP582 Spider. Nobody can fault Lamborghini for not maximizing its tiny product line. As soon as a new wrinkle is introduced, it filters down to the entire lineup as surely as night follows day in a carefully spaced cadence intended to keep people's attention on the house of the bull. Thus, as a prelude to this year's Los Angeles Auto Show, Lamborghini has unveiled a rear-drive Huracan Spider, which joins the Drift-O-Matic rear-drive coupe introduced late last year and the four-wheel-drive Spider that came earlier this year. The LP582 Spider runs a slightly detuned 571 horsepower 5.2-liter V10, as does the coupe, directing its 398 pound-feet of peak, and peaky, reached at 6,500 revolutions per minute, dork exclusively to the two fat meats in back. Some mild cosmetic changes in front are said to increase downforce to compensate for the loss of about 75 pounds in front axle driveline hardware, and the price should drop a bit, as it does with the rear drive coupe. Although the price of the new Hurricane model has not been announced yet, the LP582 coupe lost more than $37,000 from the LP610 4S base price. Surely traction plays a role. But we're also guessing that Lamborghini's figure is conservative and the Spider, on 19-inch carry wheel shot with Pirelli P0 tires, should be a few tenths quicker than the estimate. Certainly the 198 mile per hour advertised top speed is quick enough to clean off any loose follicles from your head, should you first engage the roof in its 17 second folding ballet, which is possible at speeds up to 31 miles per hour. Lamborghini said the suspension, steering, and electronic stability controls have been retuned for rear-wheel drive and that the weight balance shifts to 40% front, 60% rear, 